Hi guys, so in this video, I'm going to show you guys how you can actually get back to your disabled Instagram account and basically I'm just going to give you some links where you can actually contact Instagram directly and the links is in the description, in the video description, so check that out. But before starting, very important not only appeal once through each link okay basically you can actually use all the links you can actually appeal from all the links but only one time okay don't send multiple appeals uh, using one link that is a very important one because if you send multiple uh, appeal through one link they they will take it as a spam or bug and it will take more time than usual to reply to get a reply from uh, the instagram or they just don't reply at all okay so that is a very important one only appeal once from one link okay so anyway i'm just gonna guide you through all the links so let's go so in this uh, link first type your full name and your instagram username whatever it is and your email uh, address listed on your instagram account your disabled instagram account okay and then your mobile number and then just tell them why then your disabled account should reactivate and then just send it so in this link they are actually asking is this account used to represent a business product or service so if it is just uh, click yes and basically type your full name your instagram username and your email address listed on your instagram account and also tell which country are you contacting them from and also provide verification of the business by submitting copy of one of the following which is local business license tax filing invoice certificate of formation articles of incorporation utility bill proof of domain name registration or order fulfillment uh, fulfillment uh, documentation and then just basically uh, uh, send the jpeg version of it here of that document here and just tick i understand and send it but the account is personal just uh, tick no and basically full name and instagram your instagram username your email address and which country are you contacting from and then then just send it so in this link they are actually asking do you have a valid government issued photo id for example passport driving license etc so if you have a valid government issued photo id then just tick yes and then just uh, type your full uh, name and your instagram username and then your email address and which country are you contacting from basically your country okay and they are actually asking uh, to provide a copy of your government issued photo id so whatever it is uh, for example passport driving license other things like that and then just uh, upload the uh, jpeg version of it here and then just click i understand okay so if you don't have a government issued photo id then just click no and type your full name your instagram username your email address and which country are you contacting us from your country okay and they are actually saying that if you don't have a government issued photo id you can provide two different forms of id from the following list which is a bank statement bus card check credit card employment verif employment verification labor record mail magazine subscription stub medical record membership id pay and uh, paycheck stub permit school card school record social security card utility bill or yearbook photo so you can actually upload any of these two different forms in place of a government issued id uh, here and then just sent okay so don't confuse it by facebook and it is actually a instagram appeal link after all instagram and facebook are running by uh, same people 
<laughs> so don't worry about that and here they are actually asking is this account used to represent a business product or service if we if it is yes and type your full name your instagram username your email address listed on your instagram account and which country are you contacting uh, them from and provide uh, the verification of the business by submitting a copy of one of the following local business license tax filing invoice certificate of formation articles of incorporation utility bill proof of domain name registration order fulfillment uh, documentation and then just upload the business documents uh, as jpeg here and then just type a uh, click uh, and start and then just send okay but if your account is personal just click no and only type your full name and you know, instagram username your email address and which country are you contacting us from and then just send so in this last link just take i understand and wish to continue and type your name your email address and your instagram username and here they are actually asking uh, explain why you believe that the content should not have been removed so in this case your instagram account right so just explain to them why your uh, account should not have been removed and here you have an option to attach any file any uh, photo file so think it's it's an optional uh, it is not necessary so if you want to add just add the screenshot of the window where it's saying your account is disabled okay just screenshot them and just upload it okay it is not necessary okay and after that just confirm my content was due, uh, removed due to a violation of instagram terms of use and i believe that i believe this content should not have been removed and then just do your electronic signature basically type your full name and but remember that it should match your full name okay so the one here it should uh, match it so and then just send so anyway uh, i hope it is helpful for you guys i think i provided you five links so i hope one will work for you and you will get your instagram uh, account back so anyway uh, see you guys on the next video